What's cracking? It's Carpet Mike here from CarpetExpertBlueprint.com and in this video I'm going to walk you through step by step how to carpet a bedroom that has seams in it, how much income potential that actually has, and when you forget certain tools, how to improvise and make things happen to get the result. Never ever settle, never fold, always get the result. So as you can see we got one funky camera angle going on in this one. Why? Because the tripod got left at home. But let's focus on this video here. We're bringing in little sections of padding now I always recommend if you're an installer you're new to the game or a veteran always roll up your pad balances and stick them to the side because you can cash in on these extra little pad remnants on these small bedrooms here so we got our spill block padding we're setting up each section stapling it all down getting everything prepped out and ready now we're bringing in the second section a little bit obnoxious but don't worry it'll pad your pockets with that good good cash flow in the end so once we finish Tetrising all this goodness together here. We're going to staple it in place, get that piece of carpet set up, get it unrolled, and get ready to get the stretching done. Now, oh, wait, more Tetris work? All right, so just a little bit more Tetris work. This is like four hours worth of Tetris pad, but once again, totally worth it. Not really, it took us like 30 minutes. But save your padding so you can use that to profit more. Now we got the carpet set up. We're going to go ahead and start kicking this on, getting all of our set wells secured and in place. And then we're going to go ahead and reinforce the tag strip to lock in the crab stretcher and get that good, good stretch going across the room here. So we got our set wall set. Here's our length stretch. We're going to go ahead and get that. We're going to have a tea break real quick. Then I'm going to blast that on, work my way down, pull all that slack. And this time of year, it is so humid, finally, that we get those amazing stretches on the carpet. Not like the winter time where you try to stretch it and the carpet rips in half. Oh no, right about now, everything's like working with a piece of butter. Now we have the hallway carpet right there. I had to stretch that up because it was a little bit wavy and we wanted to seam to the new carpet we're putting in, but we didn't want to seam bubbles in place. So wanted to resecure that. Now we're cutting our doorway seam. We're gonna notch that out. Go ahead and get the tape under it. Get our seam iron. We're gonna go ahead and burn, burn, burn. Give it a few minutes as soon as we're done. Then we're gonna stretch across it and finish working out this room here's the two closets man i'll tell you what for a 12 by 15 piece of carpet there was a whole lot of seams in here two closets with seams in there we actually quarter turned the closet fills because hey it saves the clients money and it gives us the ability to do one piece seams versus two piece seams very much frowned upon by many of the professionals in the industry but hey if the client's good with it you're good with it everybody's smiling you go on make those things happen there now that everything has been burned in place ready to rock we can finish stretching this on and then we'll get on to the most important part where you really need to pay attention is the money so we got that closet seam there gonna work our way across just get that melted in place all right one down good to go slide that iron out boom boom okay on to the next one tip the iron over 45 times i said iron i meant the camera there Man, a $10 tripod just sitting on the table at home from videos from the night before. But like I said, whatever it takes to get the result, you make that happen. Take on that MacGyver life in this carpet industry here. Whoo, seams are done. Let's finish stretching this on here. We're going to reinforce this piece of tack strip because if you don't, the crab stretcher will just pull it right out of the ground and we don't like that. We're going to go ahead and kick that up. Got my good mask, got my good rubber gloves on. Don't want to spread around any COVID. Don't want to pick up any COVID. Going to go ahead and carry on some conversation oh we were watching uh fred durst doing a guitar solo there that's why i was paused for a moment why fred durst came up in conversation i have no idea but i actually looked up his net worth he still has 15 million dollars so i'm very thankful the front man of limp biscuit saved his cash good for him like him or not he got 15 milli so he's doing okay in life as far as i know hopefully he's not negative 20 million in bad investments there and we're gonna go ahead and finish cutting out these final corners trim 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 tuck 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 now this bedroom with a bazillion seams in it gross sale on this was 480 dollars we used pad remnants that we had left over from other job sites so we were able to save some money there and the material cost for the actual piece of carpet was 250 dollars so we made 230 dollars on a holiday where everybody was able to take off we went ahead and put in a few hours just to get our hustle on keep that cash flow coming in because you never know what the future brings and biggity bam Client's happy, I'm happy, and we can move forward amicably. So if you are interested in this carpet and flooring game, get over to CarpetExpertBlueprint.com. Get those passive income blueprints. I'm going to be setting you up with all the strategies you need to become profitable and make things really happen. Get that financial freedom you're after. Thank you so much for tuning in. I'll see you in the next video.